Welcome to News in Brief, I'm RJ at Global Network. Grand Ayatollah Shuazi Central Office honors Lady Fatima Maridam. On the Maridam anniversary of Lady Fatima, peace be upon her, commemorations were held at the Central Office of the Grand Jury Ayatollah Shuazi in Holy Komiran. The commemorations were attended by Islamic scholars, teachers, and students from the Islamic seminaries and the public groups of Shia Muslims. It is noteworthy that these commemorations will continue for three days, beginning on Saturday, February 11. Following the same trend, Islamic centers and seminaries affiliated to the Grand Jury Office hold commemorations worldwide. Free Muslim slums terror attacks outside Afghan Supreme Court. Free Muslim Association affiliated to Imam Shwazi Walt Foundation expressed its strong condemnation over a deadly terrorist attack on the Afghan Supreme Court in Kabul. The statement by Free Muslim Association also demanded the Afghan authorities to bring the perpetrators of this quietly attack to justice. More than 20 people were killed and injured after Dutch elements attacked the Afghan Supreme Court on Tuesday, February 7, 2017. In the end, Free Muslim Association prayed for the victims and those who were injured to be forgiven and have a quick recovery. Lashin Mayor meets head of Imam Shwazi Walt Foundation, Messer Claude Dauphin and Lathan Brian Cunningham. The mayor and chief police of Montreal, Bra of Lachine, paid a visit to Imam Shwazi Walt Foundation and met with Sheikh Salah Sibawe, the director of this foundation. In this meeting, Master Dauphin expressed his sympathies and condolences over the recent shooting in Quebec and voiced the readiness of all government agencies in providing security to the Islamic centers and mosques in Canada. Alpha Center explores post-Dutch threats in Iraq. Alpha Center for Strategic Studies hosted the conference to explore and encounter post-Dutch threats in Iraq. This conference was attended by academic figures, legal experts, and directors of other research centers in this country. One of the experts at this conference, Dr. Radil Abuderi, a professor at Baghdad University, talked about the security, social, and economic challenges ahead of Iraq and offered his solutions to encounter these challenges.